Alright, hello everyone, welcome back to Zelda 2. Um, last time we went through the second dungeon and fell miserably. Um, and now, um, I have someone joining me for the rest of this torture, so it's not as unbearable, so, yeah. Hello, I'm ScrappyFan92, and I would like to correct my friend Harry, that it is going to be more unbearable with me. <laughs> I yeah. I stutter. I pause. I am the perfect Let's Play commentator. Well, it's probably going to be a more interesting because I started to run thin on commentary near the end of the last session, so... But it's going to be interesting here because I don't remember jack or where I'm going to go right now, so... I'm just going to be kind of wandering around at the moment. But... Um, <laughs> Like oh. two. Hmm? Wait, what? It's like we're like two explorers going to the old, unexplored west of NES games. <laughs> like, mm. right. that. Hmm? I'd like to get most of the game done uh, today, if that's if that's possible. By all means. Uh, I think there's a secret somewhere around here. I'm trying to remember what I saw from SGB. Cause I, I miss, I, I was a complete idiot and missed a, um, missed the healing spell, which made the second dungeon like a hell, hell to go through. They're saying it won't be a problem with the healing spell. It probably, it will still be a problem, but I'd at least have some, uh, some backup. Here we go. This should give us something. Oh, right, yeah, I need that, okay. So now we can go to a village. Well, you already met error? Yep. Hmm. Oh, gosh. Get used to seeing that. <laughs> Ah, oh, dang it, man. What even don't... are them? Are those things? They're like... Cat... Like, cat frogs. Zella 2 has some weird enemies. Yeah. And this portion reminds me of the Super Mario Brothers level with the flying fish. Yeah. This one's even... more annoying. Is that game over? Yes, it yeah, is. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> I... <laughs> I, I, I at least want to get the stuff around in the this forest area, because I don't want to have to restart and do all this again. Yeah, still on the path, because I don't think enemies appear when you're on going on the. So. Why are you, hmm? you trusting your sword as you jump? That, that's just something I like to do for fun. Oh. Yeah, I want health. I can give you magic. Uh, I don't want magic. Hello. Bye. Bye. <laughs> no one wants to heal me. I can help you cross. Well, that, he's just taking your word for it. Hmm? The man's just taking your word for it that you know, Bagu? <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah, I don't know. That's a... Just to go back, I guess. So. Wait, what? Water Town. Oh, sorry, I'll. I like how the town names become sages in the later games. Yeah, should this one should have been Ruto, but yeah. Oh, this is Death Mountain. I don't want to go here yet. Wait, where? 
Can you uh, look up where the healing spell is? Because I need that before we do any of that. Uh, go to Death Mountain. Yeah, let me use my phone so I don't mess up the screen. Yeah. Let's see. I'm gonna have to probably be consoling guides a lot. Real men use the hotline. Yeah. Oh my. It's not as bad as Zelda one in the in the sense that it's like really um what's the word? Hard to figure out where things are sometimes, but it's still not the best. Oh yes. Fairy. It's where the fairies actually look like humans in these games, but then after that they're just orbs of light. Yeah. Alright, level two healing spell. I got some pee bag. Over here, maybe? I'm going somewhere, I can say that. Alright, I'm checking game facts. That's always like... a good place to go. Oh, okay. no, it's just, just a fairy. Just a fairy? I don't want that. <laughs> Alright, so good. The life spell is found in Saria Town. Oh. Oh, it's in the town? Uh, yes. You must pay a mirror hinder under, hidden under a table in one of the town's houses. Huh. Hold on. Can I... How do I... I need to... Oh, it's probably in an, another town where I have to get the mirror. Hmm. I'm back. Oh my gosh, what is going on? Wait. Alright. Okay, so I'm just gonna... Look everywhere. Oh yeah, there are some... That is just cruelty. Yeah. I lost my mirror. Yep. Did I actually find it? What the? Did he just apologize before attacking you? Yeah. Uh. Ooh. Oh, I'm. A... I keep thinking Did... that B's gonna make the text go faster. Did Link just speak? I think. So. I think it's implied he did. What the hell kind of Zelda game is this? Yeah. Yay. Whoa, Scarlet Sword. Look. Skyward Sword Link technically does talk. You just don't hear him. Alright. The spell I should huge. <laughs> the spell I should have gotten like what I don't know, four parts ago or or so. Depending on what part this is. Oh my. Well, well you have the life spell. Oh that's life. Gonna no pun intended, but that's going to be a lifesaver now. Hmm. Oh my gosh. Why did I get this before? Alright. Uh, do I really want to use up magic now? I think it might be better to just kill myself now than go back here. So I can reset this everything. Die! Can't even swim. Pete's sake. I find it hilarious how you can die from bubbles of all things. Also, is it... Is it just me or does Zelda look kind of look like a shoe? Yes. Yes, she does. I... I don't know why. I always thought that she looked like that. 
right. in the speaking of Zelda, this is a very confusing plot. We have mm. we have that Sleeping Beauty, who is not the Zelda from the first game, but she predates her in a grand timeline technically. Yeah. I, I... So, gets... so when you wait, when you get to finally wake her up, it just gets a little confusing on what we do now. Yeah, I mean it's like this. I'm assuming this link is the same from the first game, but the Zelda is a different Zelda, so I don't really get that. Yeah, it's the same link from the first NES Zelda. Same so Impa. Same Impa. Yeah, well, yeah, Impa technically debuted in the early games. Hmm. Like, like Impa, the like the Impa warned Link in the manual, and that's the that's the that's excuse me. She is the I guess the maiden of the first game Zelda, who's yeah. presumably still ruling kingdom. Yep. Hey, oh, this is the wrong way. So it's just very confusing. I do. I want to know what happened to the Zelda One Zelda. I'm presuming she's just ruling her kingdom. It's like screw you guys. I can't be bothered to rule this place anymore. <laughs> and just left. This is the uh, only Zelda. What? Uh, this is the only. Ze Excuse me. This is the only Zelda game where Zelda has any siblings. Hmm. Person who put Zelda the first, like Zelda the sleeping sleeping beauty Zelda, under her spell yeah. was actually her brother. Yeah. Well, I've already been here, haven't I? Right. Yeah, I think I've been here. So what do you think did a town system better? This or Castlevania 2? Uh, I haven't actually played Castlevania 2, so I can't really say too much about that, but I've heard that that game isn't much better with it. Just a whole lot of... I mean... <laughs> yeah, I, I, don't, I don't mind this game in concepts, like being a side scroller, like... Something different, I don't mind that, it's just the fact that it's so ballsy hard. Because I've never been in uh, this game. Not even, not even just as a kid, just in general, I've never been in it. I used to own a Zelda collection on the GameCube and nope, did not play this much. Oh, you're talking about the collector's edition? Yeah, I was kind of a stupid kid to throw a set for that. Oh yeah, I got the uh, collector's edition as well. It won't. Zelda one and two won't work on this on this TV for some reason though. It's like I don't know why. It's really weird. Well, that's gonna be the devil. I think it's Firebrand from Marvel vs. Capcom three. Yeah. Wait, how do I? Okay. Oh yeah. Thankfully, it's a lot more bearable than in that game. At least I've never played Ghosts and Goblins, so hmm. I'm a bit scared to honestly. You know, I made peace that I will probably never have any good experiences with most NES games. Hmm. Yeah, I, I. My first home console was the N64, so. Oh, yes, very, very. I need that badly. So, do you eat them, or do they use magic? Uh. Well, in the, in the 3D games, they just go around you, then disappear, so. I'm assuming a similar thing's going on here. That'd be so weird, like, eating the fairies. I mean... I'm assuming Mario actually eats the... power-ups. 
Yeah, um, like the mushrooms, yeah, I can see that. Maybe the fire flower, not sure about the cape feather. Yeah. And it stopped. Oh, okay. And recording again now. Alrighty. Okay. You know, Bagu. I think it's meant to be bug. Yeah, that's what I, I read a super game, but I was mentioning that also. Yeah, it's like, uh, what was it? Error oh. and bug. Yeah. So, Everyone. error's name is not an error. Yeah. <laughs> and some people thought that in the, uh, was it High Warriors Legends, like, the Lenko storyline. People thought the characters in the intro were actually Error and Bug. Who were they? They never say. So, they could still be Error and Bug, we don't know. I like to think they are. There's a lot of people from the, like, like, I mean, excuse me. There's a lot of characters from, like, the quote-unquote old days, like, 86 and 93. All of that could probably should probably come back. Hmm. Like that is very strange. Like they have always had continuity with each other, but like from Ocarina of Time onward, there just seems to be a bit of a disconnect with the old days. Yeah. I mean, I don't mind that too much because like, it gives every game like a different. Uh, uh, what was it? It makes every game feel different. So. I like that there's an actual timeline, but I don't think it was super necessary. People wouldn't stop asking them about it, so they pretty much had to. Yeah. Because I... It, it's just a personal thing. Like, I... I just like knowing when things happen in chronological order. Like, I don't have to know, but it's just a nice little thing. 